Let's get to this first game. This first game is happening this weekend. You got the USC Trojans traveling to Boulder, Colorado. Colorado's coming off of this loss, coming off of what what I can definitely say has been a super hype train from a week ago. And this week, they're filled in a whole bunch of hate, a whole bunch of Mm -hmm. critique, a whole bunch Mm of uh, long dissertations about certain things. Uh Who who are you picking, USC versus Colorado? I'm going to SC. I don't think Colorado... um, looks as bad as they looked the previous week. I think they're going to have some extra added motivation, which I love and I hate because I want them to be super competitive against us because, again, this challenge challenge is us. But at the same time, you know, I wanted them to be complacent coming into this game so we could really smack them around. I'm going to go USC. Um, I think we're going to hang up 50. I think they may do 21-28. Okay. I think we're going to give them a 50 burger. Hurt, hurt. Eric, what's your pick? I got USC in the same even close. Um, mm. I, I'm with you on the 50 burger, but I don't think they're going to put up 21 on y'all. Um, not without Travis Hunter. You, you you saw how lethargic that in, that offense looked without without Travis. They, they double teamed Horn pretty much the whole game. And, mm-hmm. and, and, and that nullified it. And, and I think, again, because of the hype train and because, you know, you had back-to-back games against top 10 teams, essentially, um, maybe even theoretically with the way that it's been going, I could make an argument for both being in the top four. Lincoln's going to have a point to prove, just like Dan Lanning had a point to prove, like you said. And I don't, I don't think it's going to be pretty. Um, mm. and, and I think they're going to have to go back to the drawing board, but at least, at least it doesn't get worse from here like you're you're still gotta go to utah that's fine man florida florida hung with utah but you know but i hear you i hear you yeah the hype train's gonna piss people off and it it clearly pissed dan lanning off (laughs) yeah yeah all right. I just hope Lincoln doesn't say anything going into the week, taking any shots. Leave it alone. Let's stay focused no on a board. national championship and playing yeah, our I... game. Forget all that fluff. Forget his prime time. Let's go in there and compete and show him who we are. Fight on. <laughs> I feel that. I feel that. I'm, I'm agreeing with you two gentlemen. I, I do think uh, USC wins and covers. The concerns that I had prior to kickoff, the season kicking off is starting to come to fruition. I said, I don't they have some good players, but behind those good players, it's a little shaky. It's a little suspect. You got more so backups, guys that were backups on other teams. Like that starts to add up. College football, guys are gonna get hurt. Guys are gonna get injured. That's the name of the game. That's part of the reason why you have the teams on that upper level being able to recruit at such a level and maintain whatever they got going on because of that depth. And you're starting to see that with Colorado. So um, I think this is going to be a rough one, man. I think that, I think that USC wins, USC covers, maybe Colorado starts off a little hot on a drive or two, but then talent is going to win this game and that's USC. 